Dr. Wood, author of the book Miracles and Minutes. Tonight, quick little thing I call it. Keep the main thing the main thing. So, <clears throat> it's post election. Uh, there's plenty of commentary on Facebook about everyone's arguing about stuff. And then the, and Donald Trump's uh, premise is make America great again. Okay, well, here's how you make America great again you need to become great. <laughs> You need to become a great person because when you go out in the world, who you are, that person, then contributes to your family, yourself, your kids, your job, your community, your state. It depends on you, not the government. The government can't make you great. You have to decide to become great. You know, you want a great uh, relationship with your kids? Well, how's it going? Well, they all hate me. Well, <laughs> maybe you don't know how to talk to them. <laughs> maybe you're not very kind. <laughs> maybe you're not forgiving. Maybe you're not loving. I don't know. What do you need to work on? We all got stuff to work on. Ain't nobody perfect. We're all born blank slates, man. Like you weren't born to potty train. You had to someone had to teach you. You weren't born learning how to, knowing how to ride a bike. You didn't even know what a bike was. You weren't born knowing how to swim. Someone had to help you. You had to put some time in. You had to do some work. And work's not a four-letter word that's ugly. If you want to be a work of art as a human being, you got to put the work in. I can't, I can't just lay my head on a book and through osmosis happen. I can't be angry with someone else who may be smarter than me. That's fine. I'm okay with it. I'm okay with myself. I can read a book. I can try to, I could do something to improve my intelligence. See, the fact is this system here called your brain is neuroplastic. You know what it means? You can learn anything you want to. You may not be excellent because you could be, you know, putting some work in in the wrong place. But you, you improve your strengths and you plug your weaknesses. So let's suppose I'm in a relationship and uh, my attitude sucks. And I'm very self-centered. Well, relationships to people, not a me people. You know, you got to be participant. You can't always get your way. You have to consider another person. It's called empathy. It is the way you truly love someone. Look it up. Empathy. Are you empathic? Not sympathetic. Empathy. It's different. Not all cognition, empathy. So if you want to make America great, make yourself great. Forgive yourself. Set some high standards for yourself. Love yourself. Put your love into your work. Then you love your work. You love everybody you work with. But you got to be loving first here before it's going to show up out there. Dr. Wood, make yourself great to make America great. Get busy.